Welcome back to Infigyan friends. Today in this video we are going to take up another challenging question from radical expressions. In this video we will simplify cube root 63 over square root 3 minus 2 root 2 minus 8. So let's get started by considering given expression as e first. Then we can write e as cube root 63 times 1 divided by square root 3 minus 2 root 2 minus 8. So we can write in this product form. Now I will simplify this bracket first. So let me write here 1 over square root 3 minus 2 root 2. Now I will multiply numerator and denominator by the denominator's conjugate. So I can multiply with square root 3 plus 2 root 2 divided by square root 3 plus 2 root 2 in the denominator and numerator. Now numerator will become square root 3 plus 2 root 2 and denominator will become square root of 3 minus 2 root 2 times 3 plus 2 root 2 by the property of thirds which states that root a times root b equal to square root a b. Now I can easily see a plus b a minus b. Here it is a minus b times a plus b written. So difference of two squares we will write over there. So numerator would be square root 3 plus 2 root 2 and denominator we will write square root a square so 3 square minus b square so 2 root 2 square with a square root. Now numerator is square root 3 plus 2 root 2 and denominator is square root 3 square is 9. 2 root 2 whole square is 4 times 2, so 8. Now I can write a square root 3 plus 2 root 2 divided by root 1. So our ultimate conclusion from this point, this bracket is a square root 3 plus 2 root 2. So I will replace 1 over square root 3 minus 2 root 2 by writing over there only square root 3 plus 2 root 2 in the numerator. So let me write here e equal to cube root 63 times square root 3 plus 2 root 2 and then minus 8. Now I can see 3 we can write as cube root 63 times square root 3 can be written as 2 plus 1 and then 2 root 2 as it is minus 8 cube root. Now cube root 63 times square root of 2 we can write it is square root 2 whole square 1 we can write as 1 whole square 2 root 2 we can write as 2 times root 2 times 1 and then it is minus 8. Now you can see it is a square plus b square plus 2ab written. So I will replace this part by writing over there a plus b whole square. So cube root 63 inside the square root this is root 2 plus 1 whole square and then we have minus 8. Now we can cancel this square root with this square. So it is left only cube root 63 times root 2 plus 1 minus 8. Now I will multiply or simplify this radicand 63 times root 2 plus 1 minus 8. So 
let us multiply 63 times root 2 plus 63 minus 8. So 63 minus 8 is 55 and plus 63 root 2. Now I can factorize 63 as 21 times 3 it is. So I can write over there 21 times 3. Cube root 55 plus 21 times 3 is square root 2. In next step we can write cube root 55 plus 21. 3 we can write it is square root 9 square root 2 then this will become cube root 55 plus 21 square root 9 times 2 it is 9 times 2 so in next step we can write 18 cube root 55 plus 21 square root 18 Now I can split this 21 square root 18 as cube root 55 plus 18 root 18 plus 3 root 18. 18 plus 3 is 21. Now I will frame one perfect cube formula. How it will be? Let me write here 51 plus 18 3 plus it was 18 plus 3 square root 18 and this is inside the cube root this is our expression so far now i will write cube root this can be written as 54 plus 1 and then it is written 18 square root 18 and then it is written 3 square root 18. Now we can consider in the appropriate order. Let me write this order first. Cube root of 18 root 18 plus 1 plus 54 plus 3 root 18. Okay. Now I will write this cube root as cube root root 18 whole cube this is a cube 1 we can consider it is 1 cube so a cube plus b cube plus 3 a square b so it is square root 18 is square and b is 1 this is 54 and last 3 root 18 we can write 3 a b square so 3 root 18 times 1 is square this is the radicand so far. Now a cube plus b cube plus b cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square. So this is identity a plus b whole cube. So in that place we can write cube root square root 18 plus 1 whole cube it is. Now this is our expression and now we will cancel this cube root along with this power 3 or cube. So let's cancel. Now I can write this is square root 18 plus 1. We can write this is our answer or we can write 18 as 9 times 2. So this will become 3 square root 2 plus 1. I hope friends this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself. Bye bye.